the Stations of the Cross. Let us pray. O merciful Savior, grant that while we follow thy blessed footsteps along this way of sorrow, our hearts may be so touched with true repentance that you may turn our weeping into gladness by giving us forgiveness of all our sins. Let the people say, Amen. Amen. O most sorrowful Mother Mary, who first followed in the way of the cross, may the most blessed Trinity, through your most powerful intercession, receive and accept in repentance for our sins, the sins of the whole world, the affections of sorrow and love, with which we intend, with God's help, to perform this holy exercise. Let the people say, Amen. Amen. At the cross her virgin keeping Stood the mournful mother weeping Where he hung the dying Lord There she waited in her anguish Seeing Christ in torment languish in her heart the piercing sword. First station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by your, your holy cross, cross you have, have redeemed, redeemed the, the world. world. Jesus is condemned to death. Look at these people in the neighborhood, jeering and shaking their fists in anger at a family different from their own that is moving into the neighborhood. You can see the bitterness reflected in their angry faces. You can almost hear the mob chanting, crucify him. What a pitiful scene. How terribly sad that they don't realize what they're doing. In condemning others because of their race, color, national origin, creed, or sexual orientation, we condemn Jesus to death all over again. How alone you must have felt, dear Jesus, when the crowd mocked you and shouted, crucify him. Forgive us as you forgave them and teach us to love and accept one another. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full, full of, of grace, grace. The Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy, mercy upon us. With what pain and desolation, with what grief and resignation, Mary watched her dying son. Deep the woe of her affliction When she saw the crucifixion Of the soul begotten one The second station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by, by your holy cross, cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the, the world. world. Jesus accepts the cross. Dragging himself along on his crutches, a crippled boy moves slowly down the hospital corridor. As he gets closest to the sunlight outside, he hears the sound of children running and playing. His cross grows heavy. For most of us, our crosses are nothing more than little trials. Do we make them heavier by complaining, or do we accept them and keep going like Jesus and this brave little boy? Dear Jesus, 
You carried the heaviest cross of all. Give us the courage to accept our cross as you accept yours. We know that you will be there beside us. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full of grace, grace the, the Lord, Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, women and, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, womb Jesus. Jesus. Holy Mary, Mary Mother of God, God pray, pray for us sinners now, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory, Glory be to, to the Father, and to the Son, and to the, Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy upon us. Him she saw for our salvation, mocked with cruel acclamation, scourged and crowned with thorns entwined. Saw him then from judgment taken, and in death for all forsaken, till his spirit he resigned. The third station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by, by your, your holy cross, cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. Jesus falls the first time under the weight of the cross. Look at the young woman trying to make change, dropping her money. She looks afraid and stares at the floor. Why can't she hurry up? I'm busy, but she isn't like me. She has Down syndrome. Making change presents challenges for her. She is capable, but works at her own pace and is endowed with humanity. Little things that come easy for us are challenging for the disabled. People like the young woman, they carry a heavy cross. Like Jesus on his way to Calvary, they fall many times. How painfully heavy your cross must have been, my Jesus. Stay close to all your people who stumble under the burden of their crosses. We cannot go on without you. Let us pray. Hail Mary, full, full of grace, grace the, Lord the Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory, Glory be to, to the, the Father, and, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy, mercy upon us. Who on Christ, dear Mother, gazes? Is by anguish so amazing. Born a woman would not leave. Who on Christ, dear mother, thinking such a cup of sorrow drinking would not share her sorrows deep. Fourth station, we adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by, by your, your holy cross, cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. world. Jesus meets his blessed mother. Still burdened with his cross and wounded yet more by his fall, Jesus proceeds on his way. He is met by his mother. What a meeting must that have been. What a sword of anguish must have pierced that mother's bosom. What must have been the compassion of that son for his holy mother? O oh, Jesus, by the compassion which you did feel for your mother 
have compassion on us and give us a share in her intercession. O Mary, most afflicted mother, intercede for us that through the sufferings of your son we may be delivered from the wrath to come. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full, full of, of grace, grace, the Lord, Lord is, is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, and, and blessed, blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy, mercy upon, upon us. Jesus made the devotion, stir in me the same emotion. Font of love, redeemer kind, that my heart fresh art organic. And a purer love attaining, may with the acceptance find. The fifth station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because, because by, by your, your holy cross, cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the, the world. world. The cross is laid on Simon the Cyrene. Where are you from, little boy? From Texas, New Jersey, Indiana, wherever there are crops to pick. My father and mother work in the fields all day, and I bring them water. I'd like to go to school every day the way you do, and have a bicycle and a basketball, but I'm the son of a migrant worker. We are afraid of what might be. We only want to live in peace and harmony. Simon didn't choose to help Jesus with the cross. The soldiers made him. But this little boy takes up his cross willingly. No one wanted to help you, Jesus, when you were weakened under the weight of your cross. We will always be willing to help others because we love you. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full of, of grace, the Lord, the Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy, mercy upon us. Who on Christ fond mother thinking, with her son in sorrow seeking, would not share her sorrows be. The Sixth Station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by your holy cross, you have redeemed the world. St. Veronica wipes the face of Jesus. As Jesus proceeds on the way, covered with the sweat of death, a woman moved with compassion makes her way through the crowd and wipes his face with her veil. As a reward of her piety, the impression of his sacred countenance is miraculously imprinted upon the veil. O oh Jesus, may the contemplation of your suffering move us with the deepest compassion. Make us to hate our sins and kindle in our hearts more fervent love for you. May your image be imprinted on our minds until we are transformed into your likeness. Let us pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, 
and And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray Pray for us sinners sinners, now now and at the hour of our our death. death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. For his people sins rejected, Savior Jesus unprotected. So with thorns with scourges red. The seventh station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because by your holy cross you have redeemed the world. Jesus falls the second time. The cross of war and conflict is always heaviest for the innocents. A little girl or boy or mother or father limps along the dusty and worn roads, fleeing from strife and death. Their villages and towns have been destroyed. The innocents are alone and frightened. The pain of their wounds is more than they can bear. They begin to cry, alone. Jesus was innocent too, but every time he fell, the soldiers lifted the heavy cross back onto his bleeding shoulders. And today the tears of the innocence of war weigh him down again. The brutal cross crushed you to the ground, dear Jesus, but you rose again and struggled on. The innocents of war cannot bear their heavy crosses alone. Please give them your strength. Let us pray. Hail Hail Mary, Mary, full full of of grace, grace, the the Lord Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, and and blessed is the fruit of thy thy womb, Jesus. Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Amen. Glory Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have Have mercy mercy upon us. So her son from judgment taken, her beloved in death forsaken, till his spirit forth he said. The Eighth Station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because Because by by your your holy cross You You have have redeemed redeemed the world. Jesus speaks to the women and children. Leave your comfortable home. Take a trip in the family car or mission bus. Go deep into the Appalachians, through the shanty towns of the Deep South, past the Indian reservations of the West, or just through the slums of your own city. There they wait in two-room shacks without windows or doors, poverty-stricken families without hope. Jesus stooped on his sorrowful journey to speak to the weeping women and children of Jerusalem. The desperate and hungry wait at their door for us today. How long must they suffer? Dear Jesus, Even in your agony, you were moved by the sorrow and suffering of others. Help us to see the needs of those around us. Teach us to be more generous to those who need our help. Let us pray. Hail Hail Mary, Mary, full full of of grace, grace, the Lord Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and and blessed blessed is the fruit of thy womb, womb, Jesus. Jesus. 
Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. Fount of love and holy sorrow, Mother, may my spirit borrow Somewhat of thy woe profound. The Ninth Station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your your holy cross you you have have redeemed redeemed the world. Jesus falls the third time under the cross. Just an hour ago, a little Asian girl ran happily down a beach with her friends. Then, in an instant, a tsunami sweeps her town away. Just an evening ago, a family boiled crawfish in their auntie's home by the levees, but the levees broke and everything was gone. Tumults and tears break our hearts when nature shows her force. Once again, Jesus lifted himself up under the heavy cross and continued on his torturous journey. This little girl shares his suffering. This displaced family seeks refuge in an inhospitable city. We rebuild or move and remember what once was. We carry our crosses in quietness. How very much you must love us, dear Jesus, to have been so willing a victim to so much pain. We offer all our crosses in return to show our love and devotion to you. Let us pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now at the end of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is is now now and ever ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have Have mercy mercy upon us. us. Unto Christ with pure emotion May I raise my heart's devotion Love to reign in every The Tenth Station. We adore you, old Christ, and we bless you. Because Because by by your holy cross, cross, you you have redeemed redeemed the world. Jesus is stripped of his garments. Arrived at last at the place of sacrifice, they prepare to crucify him. His garments are torn from his bleeding body, and he, the Holy of Holies stands exposed to the vulgar gaze of the rude and scoffing multitude. O Lord Jesus, when we gaze with lust and not love, when we seek self-satisfaction and not service to others, when vanity is our God, forgive us. You did endure this shame for our most shameful deeds. Strip us, we beg you, of all false shame, conceit, and pride, and make us so to humble ourselves voluntarily in this life that we may escape everlasting shame in the world to come. Let us pray. Hail Hail Mary, Mary, full full of of grace, the the Lord Lord is with with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. Those five wounds of Jesus knitted, Mother, in my heart be written. Deep as in your own they be. The eleventh station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by, by your, your holy cross, cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. Jesus is nailed to the cross. Hang from your cross, young man. Look at the torn flesh and beaten face of young Matthew Shepherd as he hangs from a barbed wire fence. Beaten because of hatred born from ignorance. Beaten and nailed to his cross because he was gay. Jesus, our brother, suffered and died on the cross because he loved all mankind, the people of every nation, of every shade and color and orientation. This young boy is Jesus' brother and our brother too. We must love Matthew and all others like him, male and female, trans, straight, and gay. If we don't, we crucify Jesus all over again. They were afraid of you, dear Jesus, because you too were different, and so they crucified you. Bring us closer to all our brothers and sisters so that we may learn to love them. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full of grace, the Lord is, is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have, Have mercy, mercy upon us. You, my Savior's cross to bear is. You, your son's rebuke who share is. Let me share them both with thee. The Twelfth Station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because by your holy cross, you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. Jesus dies on the cross. For three hours has Jesus hung upon his pierced hands. His blood has run down in streams. And in the midst of excruciating sufferings, he has pardoned his murderers, promised the bliss of paradise to the good thief and committed his blessed mother and beloved disciple to each other's care. All is now finished, and meekly bowing down his head, he gives up his spirit. O oh Jesus, we devoutly embrace that honored cross where you did love us even unto death. In that death, we place all confidence. From now until death, let us live only for you. And in dying for you, let us die loving you. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, full, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, 
world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. Mine with you be that sad station, there to watch the great salvation, wrought upon the atoning tree. The thirteenth station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you, because, because by your holy cross you, you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. world. Jesus is taken down from the cross. The multitude have left the heights of Calvary, and none remain save the beloved disciple and the holy women who are at the foot of the cross or striving to stem the grief of Christ's most loving mother. Joseph of Arimathea and Nicodemus take the body of their divine sundown from the cross and deposit it in her arms. Be mindful of the dignity of women. They are the child bearers, hearth keepers, storytellers, and nurturers. They are accomplished professionals and stand with equal capabilities. Honor all women, O Mary, Blessed Mother of my God, you bear in your arms your only son, now dead, who often rested his head and sleep upon your breast. Pray for us that as you hold him lifeless in death, he may bear us up in the hour of our death in his everlasting arms. Let us pray. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Have mercy upon us. To my parting soul be given, entrance at the gate of heaven, and in paradise a place. The fourteenth station. We adore you, O Christ, and we bless you. Because, because by your holy cross, cross you have, have redeemed, redeemed the world. Jesus is laid in the sepulcher. Joseph of Arimathea placed the body of Jesus in a tomb which was hewn in stone and which had never held a body. Meanwhile, the women who had come from Galilee with Jesus were following behind. They took note of the tomb and how the body had been laid. Then they returned and prepared spices and ointments. And on the Sabbath day, they rested. We have much to learn about God's resting in silence and solitude. Even though we are surrounded by the racket of our world's preoccupations. We can rest in God's silence and solitude and let it bear fruit in us. It is a rest that has nothing to do with not being busy, although that might be a sign of it. The rest of God is a deep rest of the heart that can endure even as we are surrounded by the forces of death it is the rest that offers us the hope, uh, hope that our hidden, often invisible existence will become fruitful, even though we cannot say how and when. It is the rest of faith that allows us to live on with a peaceful 
in joyful heart, even when things are not getting better, even when painful situations are not resolved, even when revolutions and wars continue to disrupt the rhythms of daily lives. This divine rest is known by all those who live their lives in the spirit of Jesus. Their lives are not characterized by quietness, passivity, or resignation. On the contrary, they are marked by creative action for justice and peace. But that action comes forth from the rest of God in their hearts and is, therefore, free from obsession and compulsion and rich in confidence and trust. Whatever we do or do not do in our lives, we need always to remain connected with the rest of the Holy Saturday when Jesus lay buried in the tomb and the whole of creation waited for all things to be made new. Let us pray. Hail, Hail Mary, Mary, full, full of, of grace, grace, the, the Lord, Lord is with thee. thee. Blessed art thou among women, women and, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Have mercy upon us, O Lord. Christ became obedient unto death for us, even the death of the cross. Let us pray. O God, we love you with our whole hearts and above all things, and are heartily sorry that we have offended you. May we never offend you anymore. Oh, may we love you without ceasing and make it our delight to do in all things your most holy will. Let the people say, Amen. Amen. Almighty God, we beg you graciously to behold this, your family, for which our Lord Jesus Christ was contended to be betrayed and given up into the hands of wicked men and to suffer death upon the cross, who now lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, ever one God, world without end. Amen. Amen. This concludes the Stations of the Cross.